Hey guys, what's going on? It's Logan Allen, and this is my interview for Artist Voice. Jump into it. All right, so first question is, describe how you felt when you found out that you got the role for Kyle Townsend in Sweet Magnolias. So when I got the role, um, I was actually in the Publix parking lot and my mom just got back to the car because she went in to get something and I was like jamming out a little bit, you know. When she got back to the car, the timing was weird. My agent called me right as she got back in the car and she was like, hey, you got the role for Kyle in the Netflix gig that you auditioned for like two months ago. Congrats. And it was just, it was incredible because, I mean, that's always been one of my dreams is to be on a Netflix show or a Netflix film. Just a Netflix thing in general has always been a, a dream of mine. Um, so just being able to, to get that phone call and, and to have it be official, it was, it was incredible. It really was. Um, so yeah, that, it, was just, it was pure joy, really. I mean, I just, I, it was literally unbelievable. Like, I couldn't believe it. Um, so yeah, just pure joy. Uh, second question. Um... Did you expect to hear that this series, Sweet Magnolias, got renewed for a second season? Um, you know, yes and no. Um, yes, because it's such a great show. Like, it really is. I mean, just everything about it. The message, the acting, the characters, the directing, the, the writing. Everything is just a 10 out of 10. Just phenomenal. Um, so, yeah, just, yeah, I think just... The, the quality of the show, like, by itself, I think, deserved a second season. And I expected a second season, especially when it reached number one in the Netflix top ten, which was just insane. Which was actually, like, a, a year ago, I think, from tomorrow. Um, which is just wild. Um, but yeah, and so, so yes and no. No, because, you know, there's a lot of really good shows that never get renewed for a second season and only has one. Um, so I didn't really know what to expect. But I, I was very hopeful, for sure. Uh, third question, do you and your character, Kyle Townsend, have anything in common? Uh, yeah, you know, we're both actors and we're both uh, the middle child, um, so I gotta relate with him there. Um, and also, you know, it's just a, a teenager kind of going through life and navigating through life, so um, I connected with him on that. You know, I'm, I'm 16, gonna turn 17 in two months, um, so I'm around Kyle's age, so, you know, I'm, I'm kind of, you know, experiencing that, that teenage life as well and, and just kind of... Uh, you know, finding my way through life in, in general, and I feel like Kyle's doing the same, the same thing. You know, learning life lessons as he goes on. So, uh, I think that's that's how me and Kyle relate. Um, what kept you up during the quarantine period? Netflix and just movies and TV. That's it. Um, <laughs> you know, when I wasn't outside, you know, um, just working on the ranch and animals. I've cows and horses. Um, but when I'm not doing that, I'm, I'm inside just watching TV. Uh, you know, I watched a lot of Stranger Things. Um, I watched a lot of Survivor. Like, I, I actually came into, uh, came across Survivor. You know, Survivor was a show my parents watched a lot back in the day. Like, early 2000s, like season two, three, like around there, like when it first started. Um, so, you know, I, I kind of came across it. Uh, when, uh, I forgot what... I can't remember what streaming service had it, but um, it actually eventually made me get the Paramount Plus uh, streaming service as well so I could watch all the episodes. So yeah, I, I became a, a survivor freak for sure. Uh, I binged a lot of the seasons. So yeah, just TV and just watching movies all the time is basically what kind of kept me going during quarantine. Describe Kevin and Bernie the Dolphin. Um, so yeah, Bernie the Dolphin's a fun family film. Like if you guys are ever gonna do a family movie night and you don't know what to watch, put in Bernie the Dolphin. They, like, the kids are gonna love it. Um, you know, it, it's, it has that amazing humor, that awesome just adventure. Uh, it obviously has dolphins and stuff in it, so a kid doesn't love that. And uh, also, the parents will see a lot of people, a lot of actors they know. Um, you know, Patrick Muldoon and uh, Kevin Sorbo, you know, Hercules. You know, he was in, uh, <laughs> he was the old Hercules. Um, <laughs> so yeah, he, uh, he's great, and, and, and there's a, a really great cast surrounding it. Um, so yeah, uh, but describing Kevin, Kevin is a, uh, a videographer, photographer, um, you know, he loves directing things, um, his dream is to be a director, um, so that was really fun playing him because I want to be a director as well, uh, so you know, him and I related uh, a lot when it came to that. Um, so yeah, Kevin, he's also very dedicated to what he does, uh, very, very self-driven um, and a really fun character to play for sure. 
Um, and same thing, he's kind of navigating through life, you know, so that was really fun to play. Um, and any word for your fans? Uh, yeah, um, you know, uh, if you haven't seen Sweet Magnolias or Bernie the Dolphin, go check it out. You guys are going to love it. Um, it's great for the whole family. And I think, you know, also just, uh, in, I guess in general, just keep going in life, you know, uh, never give up. Just keep in mind, you know, every day is a new day. Um, so take advantage of that, you know, uh, just use it to take one step closer to being the person you want to be, one step closer to, to achieving your goals and your admiration. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. But uh, just keep going in life, man. You never know what it's going to bring you. It's, it's very, uh, very, um, very wild for sure. Uh, but it's, uh, it's very giving. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. But uh, that's all the questions. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, especially if you made it this far. I really appreciate it. Um, thank you to Artist Voice. I really appreciate it as well. And I will see you guys in season two.